Nigeria has officially made a proposal to the International Olympic Committee to host the 2022 Youth Olympic Games in Abuja. At a video presentation held in Abuja, the Minister of Youth and Sports, Solomon Dalong, assures the visiting members of the IOC that Abuja will be ready to host the Games if Nigeria gets the nod. The IOC Associate Director for the Youth Olympic Games, Antoine Gauthier, says that the process of uh, securing the bid to host the Games will cost nothing to um, enable weaker countries with the potentials to host the event. The IOC has also emphasized that countries seeking to host the Games should not build new structures but instead improve on their ex existing ones or make use of temporary facilities which will be dismantled after the Games. More stories now. The president of the Confederation of African Football, Ahmed Ahmed, will be laying the foundation of Real Madrid Academy in River State on May the 28th. This is according to the governor, Nyetamwike, during a solidarity visit of members of the sports community in the state over his Power of Sports Award in Brussels, the first African to be so honoured. The government is also looking to engage more youths from the streets by investing in sports development. The only academy that the whole world will know, and our youth will want to partner and be involved. And then you see the arrangement. On 28th of May, the foundation will be laid. People are coming from Spain, from the River Madrid Academy. The CAF president will be here to lay the foundation. And I want to say, it gives opportunity to our young girls and young boys. The agreement we have is such that we're tattooed. All over the Lima Dibuwa website, we are trying to advertise River State. We have our young men who want to be coaches, who will be trained in Spain. We have our young boys and girls who want to go and play football in Spain. That is part of the partnership we are trying to have.